So I think the whole area of emotion sensing or affective computing, it has a great impact. I think as a society, we're now more aware on how our emotional intelligence drives a big part of like our decision making and our way of life and living. Going into the field of affective computing or emotional sensing brings a high bar when it comes to understanding the prior of the user. How do you begin to tell someone their state if you don't have an understanding of like their baseline? So having this aggregation of, of data points that are now being collected will allow to, for us to make a, a huge leap into their area of understanding as well as evaluating and providing more insight. We want to make sure that our data can be validated, it can be actually replicated. Having access to a low-cost piece of hardware that gives you relevant high-fidelity data is something that researchers are always trying to get access. Having something that has a lower price point, you can go instead of doing an experiment that you have maybe a condition A and B, now you can begin to think about 20.